I gotta be honest, front end coding is not really my favorite in the world. I really prefer back end coding and I'm gonna get to that once I kinda get all this boilerplate code out of the way for the front end. This stuff here, just setting up the cards, passing the data, setting up the routing, is really just kind of, you know, boilerplate code that you just gotta get through until you can get to the fun code in the back end where it's a lot of logic, making requests, handling data, and doing a lot of the really powerful code that is available on the server. To kind of take a break though, um, this is a Medium article that I wrote recently about iPropagator block. And if you don't know what that is, it's a really neat and interesting way to use uh, data pipelines in .NET. And you can read about them in a couple of these books here. So this is some of the backend code that I'm, I'm kind of just templating out at this point. Uh, again, it just is a lot of administrative type code until I get um, really well established in my uh, project design. Once I have the design in a, in a good spot, then I can really start the fun code. Once I have the endpoints in place, once I have all the data um, passing where I need it to be, Once I finish up a couple of these routes on the front end in my API folder, I think that's where I'm going to call today's video. So I really appreciate all you guys watching and tuning into the video and yeah, hope to see you on the next one.